Welcome to the party, boy. Sarge? Hold it right there, or your sergeant here loses his head. <laughs> you Van Cord dopes are out of your debt. Oh, man. The kid in Jarvis's squad, right? What happened? Uh, Miss Arnold, I mean, the princess, she's been kidnapped! What did you say? Sergeant Jarvis and Jack are chasing them! We have to go help them right away! Right. Where are they? In the abandoned building near the Magic Institute. There was a secret passage in the back. That's enough. I can find them. You go and warn the rest of the guild. But, sir, you can't go alone. There's no time, boy. We can't let them get away with the princess or the guild will never recover its reputation. When the going gets tough, the tough get going. Danger isn't in my dictionary. He's so cool. Thanks to you running off that they're here in the first place. No! I'll be taking this. Huh? Who's there? So you boy thugs are kidnapping now. What's your game, Nocturne? Deputy Gerald! Stop that sniveling, you fool. You interrupt him! You go now! Huh. Still haven't lost your touch, eh, Gerald? But... He looks like you're also as stupid as ever. And you're still the thieving, lying rat of old Nocturne. You shut up! I shot you up good! No, wait. But boss! He's too dangerous. I'll finish this. So, Sprinting Shadow Nocturne finally steps forward. <laughs> Looks like these two have a history, huh guys? Elmo. If you don't shut that mouth of yours, I'm going to skewer your tongue. Just like this. <laughs> Boss! don't need the princess either. Just leave her here. <laughs> what a waste!
Did you see them? No, they're not here. Damn it! These bandits move fast. Looks like they've gone for now. Right, here's our chance. Let's go. We have to run again? But I don't think I can go another step. Do you want to go to jail? Uh, no. Hmm. Not a bad night's work. No kidding, that corrupt merchant had quite a stash hidden away. <sighs> What's up with you? Well, I just can't help thinking it's wrong to steal from others, isn't it? You're worried about that now? It's kind of late for misgivings, you know. Listen, we're really careful, okay? I mean, we only steal from guys who deserve it. Okay. That's right. We don't hurt anyone, and we don't steal from poor folk. That's how honorable bandits always work. Honorable bandits? Yes, I, I think I see what you mean. Maybe. Right. Plus, we always turn down the shady requests that come into the guild. Unlike that creep Nocturne and his thugs. This Mr. Nocturne accepts uh, dishonorable jobs? Oh, yeah. Real dirty work. They say his clients include some of the top people in the castle. People in the castle? Using void members? It sounds like something is afoot. Yeah, whatever. It's nothing to do with us. In Void, it's best not to ask too many questions, if you catch my drift. You know what they say, right? Curiosity killed the cat. Yes. What's with the screaming, boy? You could give a guy a heart attack. You almost gave me one. You are alive, right? Of course I am. Do I look dead to you? But I saw you get killed. Don't be so quick to bury me, kid. After what Nocturne did, can you blame us? <laughs> he deliberately avoided hitting me anywhere fatal. He was just toying with me. The arrogant scum. Well, it's better than getting killed, right? No, I won't let him make a fool of me. You and Nocturne seem to go back a ways. What happened between you two? Some other time. This ain't the toilet. Doors open. <laughs> I see you're feeling better. Oh, hey, Chief. I, I didn't know it was you. It's all right, Gerald. I'm quite used to your greetings. Yeah. Sorry, Chief. No, stay as you are. <laughs> Darn it. I'm not exactly dressed for visitors. Relax. You don't have many opportunities to rest. You should take advantage of it while you can. <laughs> he didn't look like he was trying to rest. Shut up. <clears throat> I was the princess, by the way. She's safe. However, the castle is taking this incident very seriously. They have asked us to investigate the Void community. Then I have to get ready. No. I already told you. You are to rest until you have recovered. But what about the investigation? Gerald, I think the time has come for you to start grooming a successor. A successor? I'm afraid we can expect more incidents like this to occur in the future. Well, Jack, what do you think? Uh, me?
You learned many valuable lessons from this last adventure. I think you are ready to take charge of your own squad. Jack Russell, you are now a sergeant in the guild. A sergeant? <laughs> hey, it's no big deal, Jack. Heck, if Jarvis here can do it. And just what is that supposed to mean? I want you to look into the Void Incident and do whatever you think is necessary. Jack, always fight for what's right and you'll be fine. If you'll excuse me, gentlemen. Well, you have to celebrate your promotion. It's time for some private lessons from Deputy Gerald on the tactics every squad leader should know. Don't you ever take a break? Ha! 